Hello everyone. Today I'm making a video about Fortnite season seven. Yes, it came out yesterday. Um, sorry I couldn't upload yesterday. There was just a lot of glitches and stuff. Um, so I have the whole battle pass already. Uh, and this is my customized skin. Hope you like it. Um, so today we're just gonna be checking out all the updates and stuff in Battle Labs. Uh, there's alien artifacts now, which you would use to customize this character. It's kind of like Maya from Chapter 2 Season 2, but not exactly. And I can't wait for next week so more for more alien artifacts to come out so I can customize my character more. Uh, so let's hop into Battle Lab and let's see this new update. Okay, we're loading in. Beep pop, beep pop, pop, beep pop, pop. So I haven't posted for quite a while. Um, I don't know why I haven't posted for a while. But I'm just sorry I haven't. I'm so close to 600. Um, I hope you guys can make it there, make me get there pretty soon. I'll be so happy if you can. Uh, Comment down below what game you really want me to play because I'll do it. And first of all, yes, there's UFOs in the game now. And they're able to shoot this. They're able to shoot plasma balls. Oh yeah, and they're able to abduct stuff. What the, I just flipped upside down. So yeah. You're able to pick stuff off even if it's not a human. So, yeah, you're able to pick a lot of stuff up. Oh yeah, I forgot even, I even forgot to show you the best part. You're able to fling stuff. Oh no, and you have three lives in the UFO. If your UFO gets knocked down, it has two more lives, and it regens and it regens all of its health. Plasma balls only really do 30 damage, which is not too good, but you know, you it can do pretty good damage. I have already got um three wins already, surprisingly. And um, look, I'm about to get my. UFO taken down. It does 10 damage to me, but that's not too much. You go to the floor and it has battery and that recharges once you get outside of it. Um, I'm going to abduct this NPC right over here. But first I have to get him out of his little area. Okay, he's getting out, he's getting out. I'm going to abduct the NPC if you are able to. And yes, um, llamas are kind of a, kind of able to walk now. There's a chance that you can just see one roaming around. Ah, I never knew they shot you! It's not hitting any of the shots. <laughs> abduct you and start in sadly you cannot abduct llamas okay this guy has really the oh, llama is swimming sadly you cannot abduct llamas which is sad and i will be showing you guys um the new boss which is called dr sloan they are found at corny complex which is basically a rip-off version of Frenzy Farm. And I will be showing you how to defeat them, how to defeat Dr. Sloan. Um, she gives you a Mystic Pulse Rifle, which are new guns. 
which are pretty good actually. And I'll be showing you how much damage it does and all of that. What is in here? I've never seen this. So this is definitely like gonna have something to do with the storyline, I think. This probably is gonna have something to do with the storyline. Not sure of it, but it probably is. Ooh, yay. Ah, oh, it's just a hand cannon. And I don't really like hand cannons. Time to break out of here. They will never know. Silent assassination. It's a good tactic. Hmm. How do I get down to her? I don't really know. Oh, so you break that tile and get down here. And then this is where Dr. Sloan is found. Ah! Oh yeah, and she's able to create clones of herself, which is not her mythic. She just creates clones. I need to use my shield pot. There's three Dr. Sloans when she heals herself. So you have to kind of defeat all three. It's really hard though. No! Yeah, it's really, really hard to kill them. Mostly because there's three and like 20 IO guards. But I will not retreat from my mission. I will go back and I must show you the mythic. I must. Okay, and this is the um, win umbrella, by the way, for winning. And uh, let's go fight Sloan again. I kind of need this llama. Sorry, I had to sneeze. Got to get this llama, 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 llama. Okay, that's good, that's good, that's good. Okay, and I'm ready to fight. Oh, there's the moving llama! This is the llama I was talking about. They're able to move now. Okay, I hit, missed all of my shots right there. They're kind of hard to kill because they do have a timer. You do have to kill them in a certain amount of time or else, um, or else they, yes, watch. It is about to get abducted. Yeah, they kind of just disappear. They don't really get abducted, they just disappear. But disappearing is kind of like getting abducted, so. Yes, that, that was the correct one! Here is the pulse rifle. Sloan's pulse rifle, really good. Recon scanner is another one of the weapons. It can scan where enemies and chests are. It's actually pretty good. Really useful as well. So that is the recon thing. And now, as you can see, it does, it does. Let me see. Let me check. Where did you go? They just disappeared. 
Should have disappeared. Where you go? Oh, they're above me. So, as you see, it has 38 for a body shot. I'm now going to go show you what a head, how much a headshot does. Where? I will now show you how much a headshot does if I can hit a headshot. As you can see, it does 57 to the head. It's actually not too bad, considering it has really good accuracy. And um, it's overall just really good. So that's Sloan's rifle. Um, sadly, there's no mythics just yet. I'll be showing off the battle pass that I have. And you can now collect alien artifacts for um, the, char the character that I'm using to customize his head, his face, his face pattern, his armor color, and all that stuff. But uh, I'm not gonna be showing that today. Uh, so I will be showing you the battle pass. It is kind of confusing. So, for the first skin, you have Chimera, obviously, that's the skin that I'm using. Next, you get um, a wrap called Pulse Phase, which is pretty cool, and that's a really cool loading screen, in my opinion. And then, there is this emote, which is also really cool. And then, there's V-Bucks, and then there's Chimera's Plasma Back, I mean, Plasma Pack which looks pretty cool as well. Abduction, one of my favorite um, skydiving trails. I don't really like DNA signs. I mean, I don't really like sprays. So, and then you got the fishy, the peachy. Um, I like fish. And then there's a banner icon, which does look pretty cool. And next, you got Sunny. Um, don't really like the skin. You might, you guys might. Um, another thing, do not like sprays again. And then there is this. There is a loading screen. The V bucks, like there always is. Yeah. Then there's this. Okay. And then there's um, this. It is a harvesting tool. And then there's this banner, alien abduction, abduction. And then there's alien. And then next you got the wrap and then more V-Bucks. After that, you got Voyager Sunny, which is a different style for Sunny. This is the emote. Yeah, I don't really like it. And then there's 100 V-Bucks. There is a wrap, more V-Bucks. There is the glider, which doesn't really look that cool. Oh, and then there is the loading screen. There is a banner icon, a skydiving trail, and a backpack. Next, you got Dougiemon. Um, one of my friend's favorites, one of my favorites as well. You got 100 V-Bucks, Gugmon for a banner icon, you got Chop Chop as a pickaxe, you got this as a loading screen, which is pretty cool. The glider is really cool, in my opinion. Then you got the spray, you got the little emoji, you got this. That picture's kind of spooky, spooky. And then you got the back bling, which actually looks pretty cool. 
And now, you got Joey, the guy that I abducted. Back bling, looks, so looks like something straight out of Titanfall. You got the skydive trail, which is pretty cool. 100 V-Bucks, banner icon, um, wrap. You got this skin. I mean, you got that spray. You got all, they got that emoji. The pickaxes are pretty cool. And you got the loading screen. And next, yeah, you got this emote. Joey tur turns into whoever this is, whoever the heck this is. There's the spray, which is pretty cool. There are these knives, which are pretty cool. Then there's these V-Bucks. And then there's this emote. And then there's the me little Meowsles. A little Meowsles just in there. Then you got a loading screen and a wrap. And another Titanfall looking thing. And more V-Bucks. And next, you got one of my favorites, Zig. Um, he has really cool styles. His pet is so cool. I, I just love the pet, Smack Bling. You got this as um, a loading screen. You got this as a pickaxe. He's actually built into his arm. He doesn't just hold it and then pickaxe. Then you got the V-Bucks. You got the wrap. You got the glider, which is really cool. And then you got the rest of this stuff. And next you got Sloan, which I don't really like. The one that we killed. Um, but this back bling is pretty cool. Uh, this glider trail, uh, the arm part is pretty cool, but the actual trail is not, in my opinion. And then you got 100 V-Bucks. You got the glider, which is not that cool either, but kind of cool. Um, then you got this loading screen. You got an eight ball head as a back bling. And you got this spray. Then you got the pickaxe. He's pretty cool looking. Now you got Battlesuit Sloan. Um, this is the style I'm talking about. Really cool. This is the one that, I'm act that I um, was using earlier. Then there's 100 V-Bucks. Cattle Royale. Which is basic, I don't, I don't really know. There is Kickback in Emote. There is Music. V-Bucks, Emoji, Wrap, and Banner Icon. And last but not least, you got Rick from Rick and Morty. You got the back bling, he got the, he got the butter, and then you get Rick's portal for, as a, um, as a wrap. Then you get this banner icon, which is pretty cool. Might have something to do with the storyline later. Then you got the glider, which is pretty sick. A little UFO. Then you got Hammerhead Morty. And then you got the spray. And then the dance. Okay, and then there's 100 V-Bucks and an emoji. Well, guys, that was the Season 7 video. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.